Bruce Stu School Lunch. I loved the lunch table when I was a kid, but uh, let's do it. I still am a kid. What am I, what am I talking about? <laughs> Bruce Stu School Lunch. Let's check it out. All right, school lunch. Nothing better than lunchtime to break up the school day. Give you a nice little break from learning about social studies or erosion. Goddamn, I... I only didn't... I only didn't like lunch because lunch was so short. Like, my lunch when I was in elementary school was like 10 minutes, I think. Like, flex like your arm. Which one, left or right? I don't know. You sit there with your asshole friends. Everybody's showing off their sweet lunch boxes. Too right. I got angry beavers. I got the Herculoids. I, I need to work out more. Both. Sweet ass 2D lunch box. <laughs> you know, left. from the facts of life. Anybody? God damn it, am I the only one that watches TV land in this bitch or what? You need to sit there and you eat your stupid little lunch, your peanut butter and my lunch when I was a kid was so jelly, a fruit roll so up, warm short. Kool Aid that you kept in your Jefferson's thermos. My friend Michael, he'd always have the shittiest food in his lunch that he'd try to. Offer. Do y'all ever had a kid at y'all's lunch table that just begged for food? Like never had food. Chanoff, like trade away. even went in the lunch line, never had food. Some poor bastard. I'll trade you this dirty rhubarb for your fruit roll up. Nobody wants your stupid ass rhubarb, Mike. And they're like, yeah, man, I'll I'll give you, I'll pay you back. Never pay you back. Jesus Christ. It's not our fault your mom packs your lunch like we're in the Great Depression. Of course, we could always <laughs> buy a school lunch from our manly ass lunch ladies. Lunch la oh my God, the lunch ladies. The lunch ladies, just buff shoulders. Just buff, just strongest women you've ever seen. Like the hairnet. Just <laughs> smoking a cigar. Ladies that look like they bounce nightclubs on the side. They got oh like stubble God. and dirt mustaches that would make my any- school lunch is very inconsistent. Yeah, that's how my school. Well, this is all around bad. I don't eat the school lunch. I just bring my own food. But thirteen-year-old boy going through puberty, pretty jealous. A dollar forty, please. Thank you. Now I went to public school, so I didn't get any of those fancy pants private school lunches. All you rich kids had your fucking filet mignon and your caviar. No hell. Anyone here go to a private school? Oh no, fucking hot ham. A kid in my lunch stole stole my lunchbox and, and stole what? And cheese in a bag, condensation on the inside. I got jumped and got shot when I went to school. Bro, what? Right, nice and soggy. Tastes like it's been sitting in a hot car on a summer day for a few hours. Yeah, that's your lunch. That's what we're having for lunch on Mondays. No, shit's disgusting. You fucking pack on Mondays. Now, Tuesdays, they're okay. Tuesday was burrito day. They tasted pretty good, but you pay the- All right, my school didn't have a schedule. My school did not have burritos. My school had a rotation of food. They had the dried up biscuits on Monday, right? For lunch, you had like maybe a pizza that looked like it's been in the fridge for two years. And then Tuesday, uh, for breakfast, you had a low grain, pop, uh, a low fat pop tart. And then for lunch Tuesday, you had like a chicken that was pink. And then for Wednesday, uh, for lunch, you had like a, a, a burger that with the cheese was stuck to the bun. You could put, you could put the cheese burger upside down and it's, you could put it like this and it wouldn't fall apart. Uh, Thursday, Thursday would be good days. Uh, you have like cheese, cheese sticks. And then Friday, it would go back to just the, you know, on to some barbecue. Or something, I don't know. The price right about the time gym class kicks in. You're stuck. Yeah, square pizza, uh yeah. It's all in in my in my school I've had every type of pizza. I've had triangle pizza. That's not a triangle. What am I doing? Triangle. I'm stupid. Triangle pizza. I've had rectangle, square, circle, I've had everything. Like What's the matter out there? Why aren't you playing the kickball? There's a puddle of Shit in my pants! Alright, get a hall pass. Fucking Tuesdays. Then Wednesdays, that was mac and cheese with a side of peas. Why peas, I don't know. Nobody ate that shit. Who eats peas? Maybe because it rhymed and it sounded nice, I don't know. Mac and cheese and peas. Fucking licorice and tuna fish. Omar, what? Spicy pickles and a goddamn jar of nickels. Delicious. <laughs> <laughs> and, and then there was Thursdays. Thursdays were the best days when it came to school. Yes, Thursday is my favorite day, man. School lunch because Thursday was pizza day. And if you were the dumbass that accidentally packed a lunch on pizza day, well, get ready to be made fun of for the rest of your life. Oh, you packed on pizza? I mean, the pizza wasn't necessarily good, but... Today, you know what you look like? A person that makes shitty decisions. Now, get away from me before you fuck up my life. That pizza was so damn good. Even today, as an adult, I'll be, like, sitting in traffic somewhere, and I'll just think about that pizza. Like, God damn it! What do y'all think is the best place to get pizza from? That was a good-ass pizza! Chocolate milk or regular milk? Uh, I'm lactose, so no, no, no milk. Almond milk is the good, though.
and I'm allergic to strawberries, so no strawberry milk either. It's, a, it's like the most precious thing you could have when you were nine years old. It was valuable. You could trade anything you wanted for it. I seen a kid shove a dime up his nose and then cough it out on the table. Blech. All for an extra piece of pizza. Like, dude, you're gonna give yourself sepsis for Christ's sake. All for a bag of Tony's pizza. But no matter what day it was, lunchtime would always oh, end the same. All for a bagged pizza? Say, all for a bag of Tony's oh, pizza. pizza. That's no horrible. matter what day it was, lunchtime would always end the same way. For the last 10 minutes of lunch, the man ladies would turn off the lights, which. This is how my lunch ended. You debated some game that you couldn't even play and or you lied about having a girlfriend that went to a different school man everybody had to shut the fuck up if you're caught talking one of these linebacker women would make you stand up and standing up was a bad thing i don't know we just we didn't want to stand i think the most manliest women at, at school were the bus drivers like my bus driver looked like like she had like beaten 30 people up before driving the bus like Stand up, I guess. Sometimes the lunch ladies would appoint a fellow classmate to be their little deputy. Oh, we would also play uh, with five finger roulette with like the little plastic fork at the table and everything. The game where you would get around the circle table and slap each other into one quit. Kitty and walk around, make oh, sure yeah. you weren't talking. And you'd always have that one asshole who'd let all that power go to his head. Stand up, you're talking. Fuck you, Michael. I'm not standing up. You're supposed to be on the same team, you goddamn traitor. Well, you didn't trade your goddamn fruit roll up to me, so stand up. I swear to God, Michael, I'm gonna stone cold stunner you as soon as we leave here. I am the law. So you just stand there, have everybody oogle at you until it was time to leave. Oh man, he looks like such an idiot. Look at him standing up, and everybody. Everybody else is sitting down. What a stupid idiot. Then your teacher would come and you'd go off. And that was it. Michael would get stone cold stunnered for his bullshit shenanigans and everything was right in the world. Give me a hell yeah! I dubbed it, dubbed it. That's funny.